안녕하세요 여러분 레이첼입니다 and for today's video we will be doing a review about the most talk about product right now and this is the BLK Cosmetics K Beauty I already bought the starter kit if you've watched my previous video I'm loving this so far I also attended their event and sabi na talaga only kailangan mong gawan to ng review or ng video so you guys know how much Pinay Unni loves K-Beauty and this is really promising. No bias kasi I really got it myself before I attended the event and yun nga, fortunately, in-invite din naman nila ako. And then this one talaga nung nilaunch, nang hinaya ko na hindi ako nakapunta kasi nagbagyo kami ni Day nun, diba? Sabi ko talaga pagbalik ko ng Manila, kailangan ko tong mabili and I swatch everything. Nakita nyo din sa vlog. So if you guys are interested about this, again, these are my own opinions and thoughts. If you want to know more about it, you can check it out sa kanilang Trinoma store and try and buy it for yourself para malaman niya talaga. And this one, I'm trying it on my normal to dry skin. And as a K-beauty enthusiast, these are my opinions that um, how it works. So, ito nga pala yung kanyang look sa aking face. These are all K-beauty from BLK and some of my favorite products from the brand. So, again, pasensya na kung mahaba ang intro. So, let's get started with this video. So, first, I'll be showing you the products. So, ito siya, yung kanilang K-beauty starter kit. So, ganyan yung itsura niya. Um, this one, I advise if you just want to try it out first. We have the BB Plus CC Cream Stick. And then, we have here yung kanyang liquid eyeshadow. And then, yung water tint. So, we have three products. And we have some stickers here. Which I already have sa phone ko. Kung nakita nyo, ayan. Nilagay ko na siya sa aking phone. Included this limited edition mirror. Hindi ko na alam kung paano siya makukuha. Pero kasama kasi siya dito sa um, PR kit na binigay nila. Nandito lahat yung sa stickers. Kiyopta, alam niya naman yung mga Korean brands, diba? Usually, mayroon silang mga mirror. So, ayan siya. Very handy. And it's really cute. So, those are all the products that were included in our PR kit. So, napakita ko na sa inyo. And now, if you guys are interested about the review, please continue watching this video. So, first, we'll try out this BB Plus CC Cream Stick. So, this is how it looks like with the packaging. So, ayan siya. Ganito lang siya kaliit, which I really like kasi it's perfect for travel. It's not too big and not too small. Maganda dito is, on the other end, you have the product. And then, sa kabila naman, you have the brush. I've been using this product ever since I got it last week. And sobrang gustong gusto ko siya. So, this one, I have it in the shade Ivory Beige, which is the lightest. So, kung gusto niyo makita yung swatches, I'll be linking my video here. I swatched all the collection nang pumunta ko sa Trinoma na store nila. So, this is just how it looks like. Yung sa gitna, feeling ko yung CC na product, yung light. Nakikita niyo yung light dyan. Tapos, yung around it is the BB Cream. Just that, ginaganyan ko lang siya sa face. Sobrang convenient ito, especially if you're always on the go like me, if you have work, or wala na kayong time na gawin yung makeup niya ng matagalan. Ito, meron na siya agad na ano, um, brush. So, ganyan ko siya ina-apply. Medyo madumidumi ng onti. Ayan. So, ganito pala lang yung product niya. I'll be using the brush. Para makita ninyo kung paano yung coverage niya. Feeling ko para sa iba, streaky siya. Alam mo yun, yung hindi siya yung full coverage. But again, it depends on your um, preference eh, when it comes to makeup. Pero sa akin, okay na siya. Just make sure you blend it really well. Noong una, hindi ko siya nagustuhan. But parang hindi naman nabiblend yung product. Pero feeling ko um, yung product kasi ganun siya. Dahil hindi naman siya foundation eh. Pero kung makikita nyo, it sort of has a bit of coverage. As you can see here, yun yung balat ko talaga. And then this one yung meron. So, para lang siyang cushion. Alam niyo naman, mahilig ako sa ano, cushion, na sana nga maglabas din sila, di ba? Why not? In fairness, di ba? O, oh, nakikita nyo, na-cover yung redness sa face ko kahit pa paano. Sahin natin, Scarlet Coveted Korean Glow with this hybrid skin perfector that gives you the benefits of both a BB and a CC cream in an easy-to-use stick. Which is really easy to use. <laughs> Talagang sinasabay ko siya pag ano. Biniblend ko kasi talaga siya Ayan, medyo on TV dito sa eyes. Tapos, infused with shea butter, vitamin A, and vitamin E, the rich, buildable formula expertly smoothens the skin. Nag-smoothen naman, feeling ko. And then, it conceals blemishes. Um, dito makikita nyo may breakouts ako. Ayan, nakikita nyo yung redness dito. Tingnan natin kung makukonceal nyo talaga. Hindi siya high coverage, guys, na parang foundation. Again, it's a BB and CC cream stick. But it is promising for me kasi hindi ko in-expect na magiging ganito kaganda yung kanyang labas sa skin ko. Again, I've already tried the products so this is not a first impressions 
video. Medyo light lang siguro sa tignan dyan dahil sa ano, tawag dito, sa ilaw ko sa ring light. Pero, ayan, feeling ko na-cover naman kahit papaano yung nakita niyo yung parang pimple ko dito. Pero, um, again, it depends on your skin. Um, hindi naman kasi hindi siya talagang nakaka-cover pero somehow it does. So, this is the finished look for the base. Gumamit lang ako ng concealer to conceal the under eye circles. Pero for the base, I just use this one, yung kanilang BB Plus CC Cream Stick. As you can see, medyo nagsettle na siya. So, antayin nyo lang siya for a few minutes. Kasi sa una talaga, magmumukhang put maputi siya. I think it's also because of the CC, um, yung conceal and correct. Alam nyo naman, pagka CC Cream, medyo mas maputi siya. Pero, um, so far, so good naman siya. I've been using it for the whole week because I really love the convenience of the product. I just think na hindi siya sobrang okay sa oily skin. Again, I have normal to dry skin. Pero pagka the whole day kasi, like after work, nakikita ko na gusto ko pa din yung effect niya kahit medyo nag-fade na siya, pero fresh pa din. Pag gusto niyo ng fresh-fresh lang na look, okay to. Pero if you're looking for something that's high coverage or that will last you the whole day, hindi ito yon Kasi again, this is um, a BB Plus CC cream stick. Alam niyo naman, pagka Korean product, it's just more of giving you that glow or enhancing what your skin has. It really doesn't cover everything. So, Ayan, ganyan yung itsura niya sa skin ko. I really love the glowy effects. But anyway, ayan, um, sana lang maglabas sila din soon ng concealer. But this one for me is okay siya. I'll be putting the prices here and also the shades. You can check out my vlog din para sa ibang swatches. But so far, so good. This one, I love this product. And so, we're done with the base. And next is this product that they raved so much nung launch. Kahit si Anker, it's sobrang favorite niya to. And it reminds me of a lot of Korean products out there. I mean, yung mga high-end sa Korea. And this is a creamy cheek paint. I have the shade Peach. Dalawa lang yung colors niya. I think the other one is pink. Andun kasi sa vlog, pasensya na kung hindi ko sobrang memorize. But this is how it looks like. Strawberry. Ayan, very, very cute. Yung alam mo yung pag-iisipan mo kung itatapon mo o hindi. So, ayan. Gusto ko dito ng swinouch ko siya. Sobrang ganda. Like, pigmented siya. And it has this applicator that mimics um, the finger. Kaya, ganyan siya. Medyo makapal siya. Ganyan usually yung mga Korean ano, um, eyeshadows or yung sa cheeks. Let's use this again. Sabi nila, one dot lang daw dahil sobrang pigmented niya. So, inaano ko lang yung product dito. Kasi medyo madami. And I will apply it on her cheeks. Isang muna. <gasps> um, pigmented nga. So, dito lang tayo. Oh my gosh. It really is pigmented. Sobrang onti lang na nakita nyo. Ang light hand ko pa siya in-apply. Hala, para kong nasampal. <laughs> Medyo makapal siya. Pero ang ganda nung ano niya. Ang effect. Eh, hindi ko in-expect na ganito siya ka-pigmented. And it blends easily. Or just a finger again, if you're into K-beauty like me, alam niya naman na pag gumagawa sila ng makeup nila, usually yung fingers lang or yung mga ganitong sponges yung ginagamit nila. They don't usually use brushes. I mean, depende na lang din talaga. Pero usually, pagka ganito, ayan lang, tap-tap. Oh, diba? Lakas maka-fresh. Oh, so, ito yung wala and then ito yung meron. Ang ganda ng peach siya. Usually kasi... Pink yung mga meron ako, pero I love peaches so much when it comes to the cheeks. Kasi iba yung dating niya. Kasi sobrang pula ng cheeks ko talaga. So, pagka pink yung ginamit ko or red, mukha na talaga akong tomato. Unlike pagka peach, nababalance out niya. So, ayan, medyo lighta na natin ng konti. <laughs> Parang ang kapal pa din. But anyway, it's really blendable. Nakikita nyo naman. Hindi siya yung pagka nalagay mo, ang hirap i-spread sa face. Parang feeling ko nakapalan ko dito sa left. Ayan, pero since uso naman yung ganyan ngayong summer, hindi ako ma-blush. Pero sabi nga nila, bakit daw hindi ako ma-blush? Dahil usually maputla yung itsura ko. So, dapat daw nagba-blush talaga. And dito, since may lighting tayo, medyo kapalan natin ng onti para nakikita nyo. Sobrang favorite ni Anne Curtis to. Like, sinasabi na nung event, paulit-ulit na Sobrang favorite niya to. Nagkamali nga daw siya kasi tatlo yung nalagay niya na dots. Na wag daw talaga. Isa lang kasi sobrang ano nung product. Pigmented talaga siya. So, ayan. But in fairness, I love it because it's very natural. It's blendable. It's easy to use. And I appreciate the fact that it has this, um, tawag dito. Yung applicator that's like a finger. Nalimot ko lang kung anong term. But, um, 
Let's see kung long-lasting siya, abusing it tomorrow sa beach. But I think it is, kasi knowing, just seeing the pigmentation and the finish, um, this is how usually yung mga Korean products. And I love it so far in the face. It's perfect for every day. I'll be trying out yung pink din. Bibilin ko din yun para makita natin. Pero so far so good. I really like it. I love cheek paints or yung mga moussey texture when it comes to um, the cheeks. Kasi hindi ako mailing talaga sa powder. But nakikita nyo naman ngayon. Okay siya. So this is how it looks like. Close up. Very natural lang siya. So ayan. Okay, so there, and next we have the Intense Color Liquid Eyeshadow. So I have two here. Yung binili ko is I Love You because you guys know how much I love coppery shades. Yun yung usually nakikita niya sa mga makeup looks ko. And then they gave us this gorgeous na shade. So maliit lang siya, super. Para siyang maliliit na nail polish. And this one I think it's the matte shade. So ayan yung itsura ng kanyang box. Sobrang cute! Ang liit-liit lang. Ang cute, diba? Maliit lang siya. Um... Sobrang liit lang talaga ng mga nakasulat. So, sana medyo kita siya. But anyway, ganyan siya. Ayan. So, ganyan lang siya kaliit, guys. Very handy for travel. Hindi ako ma-powder eyeshadow. I really love liquid. So, nung nalaman ko na nag-release sila neto, for only 299 parang ako, wow, sulit. Kasi, usually, yung mga ganito is mahal. Like, 600 800 Pero ito, it's really affordable. Try natin dito sa gitna ng ating lids. Very easy to use. Sabi nga nila, kaya daw gusto nila yung ganitong collection because you guys know what BLK stands for. It's Uncomplicated Beauty. So, ayan. I appreciate the fact na hindi siya dark. So, madali din siyang i-blend. Nakikita ba sa camera? Pero, ayan siya. Nakita niyong definition. So, again, depende na yan sa preference niyo sa Makeup, yung iba talaga bongga mag-eyeshadow. Ako, bihira niyo talaga ako makita mag-eyeshadow. Kung mag-eyeshadow man ako, yung ganito lang, yung shimmering lang. Yan. Yan. Sana nakikita, parang masyado maliwanag. Bigyan lang niya ng definition yung eyes ko. So, it's a great base para sa akin kung gusto niyong may depth lang yung inyong eyes. And then next, I'll be using this one that I bought, which is I Love You. Ang ginagamit nila dito sa kanilang Egyosal, dahil ganun ang Korean look. So, I think I'll apply it on the center. Ooh! Similar siya sa isa kong favorite Korean brand na medyo mahal. Pero ito, parang na, pat nawala. <laughs> parang nawala siya. Wait, kapala natin. Okay. Ang tap-tap lang talaga pagka Korean makeup. Uh! Kapal. Oh, nakikita niyo ba yung difference? O, di ba? Pwede nyo din siya gamitan ng ibang brush kung gusto niyo. Very Korean na. And then, apply natin to sa center. Yung I love you. I really love the color. So, this is the finished look of the eyeshadow. Sana lang nakikita nyo dyan sa camera kasi medyo maliwanag, sayang lang. Pero, looking here sa mirror, I really love the effect on my eyes. Um, I used yung matte nila, which is gorgeous, as a base. And then, pinatong ko yung I Love You um, na shade, which is a coppery shade, which I really love. And then, I applied it on my egg yourself and sa waterline, as you can see. Um, pigmented siya. It really defines the eyes. And I was shook to the core na sobrang, ano niya pala, as in, intense siya, na hindi din siya natatanggal. Kita niyo naman yung rubbing effect na to, as in, kanina pa to. Pero, ayun, lalo na yung mat, o, oh, ayun, grabe na yung pag-rub ko sa kamay ko, kaya medyo natanggal na to. Pero, ayan, ang galing, lalo na yung mat. So, maganda talaga siya dito sa waterline and sa igiosal, kasi alam mong maglalast siya, and talagang makikita pa din yung sparkle sa eyes mo. So, I really love it. It's just that, though, it's intense. Yung mga Korean eyeshadows, liquid eyeshadows, kasi na meron ako, mas intense pa dito. So, siguro meron lang akong level of comparison with that. But, this will do for only 299 I love the shades, which is very wearable. Perfect for everyday. At 299 this one is also an amazing product for me. 
So lastly, we have the lippies. Medyo madami to because they gave all of their all-day intense matte lipsticks. So thank you so much because I love their matte lipsticks. I have a lot of those nung nag-release sila last year nung kanilang unang collection. Not being biased here just because I bought those products with my own money. And then, yun nga, nabigyan lang din naman ako and na-invite. So I'm thankful for that as well. So this is how the packaging looks like. Again, Kyokta, we have here... Um, ano man sabi dito? Um, a peach, a mauve pink, and then berry red. So, ito yung shades niya. And, um, ito, kasi black yung sa matte lipstick, di ba? Dito naman, peach siya. So, very Korean. And, alam mo, yung BLK talaga yung favorite ko na lipstick sa local eh. Dahil, ano, kakaiba siya. Yung pagka-glassy effect niya. So, we have all three shades here. I'll be swatching each for you guys. Again, pero nakita niyo na yun sa video ko. Medyo hindi lang siya. Sobrang kita dahil ang gulong ang daming tao. So, we have My Love, which reminds me of My Love from the Star. So, ganyan yung itsura ng lipstick. Same lang, I think, yung kanyang, um, parang yung sa mga dati nilang lipstick. So, ayan siya. That is My Love. And then, we have Honey. Ayan. Ooh. Ano, parang pag-Korean kasi, di ba, mas light pa yung lipstick. Pero, I think, um, inanotin talaga nila to... Um, Filipina shades, wearable shades, which I appreciate. And then we have Beautiful. Alam mo, pigmented niya. Pero ayan siya. Oh. These are deep shades, which is very pigmented. And I really am shook. I think we'll go with My Love because we have also a tint, which is pink, na gagawin natin dito sa center, you know, gradient lips. So first, when I do my gradient lips, I apply the lipstick first. So let's see how this will glide on on my lips. Smooth. Kasi, kaya nito din yung matte nila na ano. In fairness, I love it. I love the shade. You can use it as lipstick lang kahit wala itong tint. And again, it depends on your preference. Pero again, it's moisturizing. It's matte, it's pigmented, and it's the same feel. And then now we go on to the most talked about and favorite actually ng lahat. Ito yung kanilang All Day Lip and Cheek Water Tint. So it's water-based. And I got the shade pink. Uh, meron silang orange, meron silang red. I love this product right off when I used it. And it's really pigmented. I'll be showing you guys the swatch. I appreciate the doe foot applicator as well. Kaya ako siya gusto kasi may pagka-violet is siya. So, ayan. So, ginagamit ko din ito sa cheeks, which is very long-lasting. And now, I'll be applying it on the center for that gradient look. So, ayan. Ayan. Cute pa. I love it. I love this tint so much. I need to get the three other shades as up. And... Patuyuin. Medyo matagal lang siya matuyo. So, ganyan siya. Ah. See? Very pigmented again. Hindi na naman siya natatanggal. <laughs> anyway, I really love this pink shade. And it's really pigmented. Hindi siya ganun nakaka-dry. Kita nyo naman. Ayan. Diba? Very natural lang siya. Ipa ako nakapag-lip balm. Pero... Hindi nagbalat yung aking lips. So this is the look. I really love it and I'll be finishing it with some of my favorite products. This one, you need this. Kung everyday na eyeliner. One of my favorites ever. Now we'll just be adding some highlights of using this. Gusto ko yung pagkasato ng highlight na to. And then a bit of contour. Because we have chubby cheeks. Pero yung contour nila is subtle lang. Hindi natin dadamihan na ano. Yung medyo ano lang siya. Gusto, gusto ko talaga yung palette na to. Pag nagtatravel ako, ito usually yung dala ko. Kasi andito na lahat eh. So that is it for my review of the products. Again, it depends on your preference. But for me, I highly suggest that you buy it yourself. You try it on your skin kasi nga iba-iba tayo. You can go to Trinoma, yung kanilang first ever boutique or store. Kasi doon ako pumunta para maswatch ko talaga lahat ng products. Kasi alam kong iba yung effect niya sa skin. I love everything. If you will ask me yung pinaka-favorite ko, I think it would be the... 
Ang hirap pala talaga mag-isa. Pero feeling ko yung tint. Kasi sobrang healing ko sa lip tints. You guys know how much I live for lip tints. And then, ito. This one is really promising. So, sana mas maglabas pa sila ng ibang bases na products, di ba? But I really love this one as well. Yung kanilang BB Plus CC na cream stick. And then, this one exceeded my expectations. I think I have an everyday product na naman na bago. Yung kanilang creamy cheek paint. I love the finish on my skin. And it's very pigmented. Tapos, this one is only, ano to? 349 pesos. I need to get the other shade as well. So, this is nice. And then, of course, the eyeshadows. Lalo na yung I Love You. You guys know how much I love copper shades. So, this one, I like it as well. Yung yung lipsticks nila, which is amazing din. Kasi it's perfect for everyday if you're really not into Korean products. But the warm shades are really wearable and nice. So, these are okay then as well. Sa totoo lang, my thoughts about this collection, I didn't expect it to be that affordable. Kasi akala ko pagka special collection siya for a brand, syempre mas higher siya ng onte. But this one, you get it, everything for less than 500 pesos. So, madali mo siyang mabili or makolect talaga. So, that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this review. Pasensya na kung mahaba, but... My love for K-Beauty in this collection really exceeded my expectations. It's a first in the local makeup industry. So I'm really happy about this. I bought it myself and then I invite ako sa event, which I'm really thankful for. So if you guys want to try it out muna, you can get this um, again, yung starter kit nila for 997 pesos. You yeah, have three products here. So that's it. Again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like this video if you learned something. And also follow me on my other social media accounts. So that's it, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you on my next video. Annyeong!